In this video, we're going to be going over creating our model, or if you can refer to it as our class. Now, what that's going to contain is all the information that we need for the server. So if we look back in Postman, we'll see five different variables. One is the server ID, IP address, server name, the current amount of players, and map name. Now, I might end up changing the maximum amount of players so that can be shown as well, but and yeah, let's actually do that too. So we'll have a total of six. So to create it, go over here to models, right click, add class. I'm going to call it server data and create it. Now we're going to be creating six public variables. So they're going to do public. First one's going to be the server ID, so it's going to be an int, server ID, we're going to do get set, and we do the same thing for the remaining, so I'm going to paste it, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so next one is, we're going to do the IP address, that's going to be a string, then server name, also a string. Then I'm going to do map name. And then the players. So this one's going to be current players and max players. So just like that. So for example, if we go ahead and create one, it would be server data equals new server data so if we look through it data dot we have current players IP address map name max players ID server name and that's what we want so whenever we go to create the JSON object inside of um, Unreal Engine that's essentially what we're going to get. I mean, what we're going to be posting. It's going to be something that contains all those values. So I want to make this return data. And what it's going to return is server data and the get request. So I'm going to go ahead and run it and check it out in Postman via get request using the same thing. I'm going to do a send. And as you can see, here's what we got directly from it. So we have the server ID, IP, server name, map name, current players, and max players. So whenever we go to pull info from the database or we make our get request, for example, from Unreal Engine, this is essentially one of the objects or one of the servers uh, objects that we're going to be receiving. We're gonna have all this information accessible to us that we can do whatever we want with whenever we go to construct the, um, the list, the server list. Hopefully this was useful and you learned something and I will see you in the next one where we continue on this.